We have uh, the running back, Jaheen White. Questions for Jaheen? Kevin? Jim, Coach Brown continues to mention your progression in practice and how it, you know, comes over, plays out during a game. Are there specific lessons, specific things that you're doing in practice that you feel like are really having an effect here, or is it just kind of an overall thing of how you're approaching the game? Oh, it's just really going hard. You know, every every time I get the ball, uh, like game light rep, um, I like score every time I get the ball. You know, at practice, so. It leads in the game. Could you take us through the long touchdown catch to start the second quarter? Um, well, so they uh, called it in the huddle, and um, the, I saw the DB. He was right there, and it was like a little 50 50, but you know, my arms, I'm a little short. So my arms, I, I reached out, got it, and then once I saw the green, it was just a go. Coach Brown talked about that actually was a play that you guys have been handing it off to, to Rodney and you've been a blocker on. Mm -hmm. So was that something that you were kind of ready for? Or was it just kind of the spur of the moment? Or no, anything? I was ready for it. We, we've been practicing that all week. Yeah. Do days like this sink in at all? Will it hit you when you wake up tomorrow? Or what to? No, I don't. It's like, I've been waiting to, you know, actually show my talent. For me to start tonight uh, was a big jump for me. And um, I just wanted to, you know, show the world, show Dub B my talent. What did you kind of know, you know, with CJ Dillon injury? When did you kind of know this was going to be your game? Right after that injury, like right after it, I knew I had to step up. Then did you go about the week any different? I mean, being the number one guy, I'm sure practice was a little bit different. But did you approach it any different? Nah, just the same mentality. You showed your strength on a couple of those inside runs too. How had it feel to just kind of push the pile and show people you can do that too? I mean, the low man win, so you know. And uh, for me to be, you know, the smallest or whatever, uh, I got more power to the ground. You know, for me to push, and then my linemen, uh, they helped me out. So yeah. Anybody let you know about what you're doing? Not only are you having big games, but even the historical significance and getting mentioned with guys like Steve Slayton and even Pat White on the ground. I mean, no, I obviously got, legendary names in the program history. No, I haven't got those yet. But, what yeah. does it mean to you to, to be mentioned with those guys so early in your career, knowing what they established here and that your numbers are getting there in individual games? It means a lot. Like, it's a big, real big time. I can't, like, you know. Big time. When, when Garrett runs for 154 and three touchdowns, what does that do for you? How much? How does that age? Well, it opens it opens it up for me, and uh, it obviously opened it up for him because, like you know, um, like we always we always run the ball, so they always you know got the eyes on us, the running backs, and for him to do that, like that was just amazing. It was good. So when they when they have to have a defender on here, can you feel that? I mean, when there's just one less guy out there for you, can it? Yeah, 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 I feel that. Do you always feel, was today one of those, I feel unstoppable days, or do you always feel that way? No, I always feel like that. Stand on business. <laughs> Stand on business. If you don't run with that sort of attitude, that sort of approach, does that hurt you? Is it, you feel like that's part of yes. be, just being able to be successful? Yes. Yeah. Okay, anything else for Jaheen? Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.